Welcome back to more Harvest Moon 3D, a new beginning, everybody. In the last episode, we finally unlocked blueprints by unlocking Rebecca and her son, I believe, Tony. So, let me actually go ahead and show you a couple of things. Now, the very first thing is edit mode. I mean, there's also blueprint mode. Like, if you go to edit mode, um, you can pretty much edit, you know, whatever the hell you want, you know, in this area or in the next area as well. One really unique thing about this game, especially when it first came out, was that you could actually um, edit different portions of the town. If you go to another section, you can actually edit the town layout and how it actually looks, which I find that to be honestly incredibly interesting. Um, so if I put like... I'm gonna put this away. I'm gonna put all this shit away right now. Because uh, I, I have a better idea on how I'm gonna be doing this. So, basically, and by the way, as you can see, EP is 9,999 here, in this section. Now, I believe my place is actually uh, much smaller, that's for sure. And this is road as well, holy crap. What the fuck? Oh my god. Um, I'm gonna put away... Alright, so... And then this whole thing, it's Shipper's house. So what I'm going to actually do, I'm going to grab this general store. It's funny how you can just lift this shit all the way over, you know? Like, it's crazy. Alright, so I'm going to do, like... Oh, yeah, but I have to move the... Oh, god damn it. Um, How do I... Returning will put your holding back... Uh, yes. I screwed up. I have to go back into edit mode. Oh, no. No, I don't want to go all the way back. Shoot. Let's try this again. Add it again. Yeah, but as you can see at the bottom menu actually shows pretty much my entire inventory and what I actually have on me. Um, so I have to move the road. I'm gonna move the road to over there. And I'm gonna put this away. And I'm also gonna actually put this away. Is that no that's nothing, okay. Well there we go. That's it for that. I'm gonna grab this now. And I'm going to move it. What the f Like that? Hold on. That one works. Only that- okay, so that works. Wait, is that right? No, that's not right. I'm trying to move this sideways. How do you- hold on. Like that, yes. I'm trying to move it like that. But I'm trying to find... There we go, like that, right? Uh, yes, actually, that's perfect. Okay, and I'm gonna... I'm just gonna move, like, these a little further. Oh, no, but there's a freaking... Oh, God. That might not fit there, actually, now that I think about it. Unfortunately, you know? That thing is ginormous, man. Yeah, it's actually not gonna fit, unfortunately. Hmm. I mean, I guess what I can do, because see, if it's if it's that much down... Oh man, that's not good. Damn, that sucks. Wait, how did I have this before? Was it over here? I think it was there. I think it was, like, right there, but, hmm. Alright, well, in that case... I'm just gonna leave it like that, um... If I look at the bottom screen here, I got a couple of interesting things that I can, like, make a good design of, but, like... I don't really know if I should, though. I mean, I can make it look really pretty, no doubt about that, if I put, like, fences all around here, you know? But then that's also being blocked off. I'm just gonna leave it like that for now. Um... I'm gonna go back to studio, yes. Let's do blueprint now. Um, so here's the thing. Supply shed, you need 10 small material stone and 20 small lumber. Okay, 10 small material stone and 20 small lumber. So I have the lumber already, but I need 10 small material stone. So if I do this... Wait, wait, no, 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 no. Place... 
10 on the ground. And I go here. And I go into hammer. Let's see if that actually worked. Did it make 10? It should have, right? Wait, that's the wrong one. My bad. Uh, yes, it made 10. Okay, so now I should have enough. Also, what's my EP for this place? I didn't even see. Well, I can't even see from here. Okay. I'm gonna make a supply shed. Uh, yes, that's perfect. We're gonna make one. Making a supply shed. What the heck is this? Alright, so we get a little nice nice cute cuts in here, watching my character actually make a supply shed with all this hard work. And look at that, multiple man again. Man, that's awesome. You built a supply shed. Oh yes, very nice. Now you've got room to store lots more supplies. Okay, but where do I put it? Supply should add it to- wait, what the, what the- Oh, I haven't placed it yet. Yeah, that's right. I just built it. So I have to go into edit mode now, I'm pretty sure. Here it is. Actually, am, am I even happy with this layout though? Let me see, because if I put like... No, I think I'm good, right? Yeah, I think I'm good. So if I just put like my... Supply shed, like, maybe, maybe I should put the supply shed over there, though. Alright, first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this. And put it back in my inventory. Oh, wait. Shoot, I didn't mean to do this. <laughs> my bad. Um, alright, so, like, if I move, like, let's say this. Over here. And I go into inventory. Um, how big is this? Okay, that's that's looking down, right? I think. So I can put it there. There we go. And I believe I can actually move this over one more space. Yeah, like that. Perfect. And I got three three fields here. If I really wanted to, I could actually move this to line up with that one instead. Oh wait, oh, wrong one. Whoops, I meant there. No, dude. Oh. I meant there. There we go. And then, yeah, so that's, a, that, that's about it for that. Um, at least for now. I don't really know. Obviously, I'm going to be making this prettier as we go, but... You know what? Just to have a little bit of fun here. No, not that one. I meant... I did not mean to do that. My bad. How did I accidentally pick that up? What? Dude, that makes no sense whatsoever. Like, what? So that's me put it there, but like... Sorry, I'm like, I know I'm wasting a lot of time here. Shit. That's not where it was. Oh, I got it now. It won't let me do that. Yeah, that, that's a little interesting. Okay, I'm gonna put that right there. That's how it was. Yeah, I don't know how I accidentally picked that up, but okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna grab one of these, just for like a little cute design, I suppose, and just put it like right... Oh, I can't even align it next to that. What the heck? Right there. Just put that right there. There we go. Okay, back to studio, yes. Alright, so sorry, it took me like 10 minutes to pretty much showcase the entire thing, but at least now you know how that works. Supply shed, I'm gonna put items in the supply shed. How much can I actually put here? A hundred different things? So like, if I come over here and put like, my copper, my scrap metal, yes, we're only taking one, so thank god. Small rocks, small branches, regular branch, and then a shitload of small lumbers. 
Look at how much space I just cleared up. That is amazing. Oh my god, I love this so much. This is just beauty. This is pure beauty, you know? Okay, so... As far as others... Oh, I, mean, I don't know. I don't know. Like, should I just... Wait. Yeah, okay, I'll just go ahead and put some stuff in there. Why not, right? Let's see here. Um, I'm gonna put... I'll keep the mills, but I want to put that in there. Actually, that's all I'm gonna do right now. I will go ahead and put the bees away. Just put them in there, I suppose. Oh, and fodder too, my bad. Look at that, I have 11 out of 30. I just cleared up a shitload of space, and I really like that. Alright, um... So let's go ahead and, um... Yeah, let's recut some stuff now, you know? Some grass. Get some grass out of it. That's gonna be nice. Cut, 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 cut. Alright, so in this episode, what I'm gonna be doing... Um, cause see, it's the 25th, so I'm actually pretty close. Well, I don't think I'm gonna make it though, unfortunately. To like, the end of the month in this episode, it's gonna be next episode. There's no way, if it's only the 25th, you know? Still got a lot to do. Alright, hello, cow. I also have fertilizer that I don't even know what the hell I'm gonna be doing with that, you know? Okay. And the milker, of course, comes in handy. Um, so being the 25th, um, what day is it? Let me see. It is the... Well, I mean, it's still, since it's still Wednesday. Let me take one more look at this other shop over here. Because I want to see if there's any blueprints that I'm going to... I mean, I am going to have to buy some blueprints. I will tell you that right now. I do have to do that. Um, but the big question is, like, which ones? Because as far as, like, things to make... I mean, you want to know specifically what in terms of reaching the goals. So, like, for example, if I go to buy a blueprint... You have a newspaper carrier, which is 2400. So I'm gonna need this one eventually. Which is why I kind of want to buy the blueprint, you know? Um, I do have to buy... Where are they? I'm gonna need to get a number... I think I'm gonna need five of these. So I'm gonna have to buy the one for that one. I also have to buy the one for Streetlight, which is gonna be this one. And then Wooden Bench as well, which is gonna be this one. So I'm buying those right now just so I can make them for the future. And then for even later, I'm gonna have to build a um, salon. Um, can you just put bushes? What the hell's a bush? Like, just a regular bush? I mean, it's not in here, but I don't know. Um, and then the newspaper carrier, but also the salon, which is not there yet. Barn coop and chick chicken feeding area are all there. That's interesting. Um, I suppose I can go ahead and buy this right now. Might as well. There we go. Okay. So that's it for that. I bought some good stuff there. That's pretty good. Uh, let me go to the general store now. So I'm down to 6,500 now, as you can see. Hmm. Oh, what the heck? Are you at lunch? Where are you at? Wait, is this closed on Wednesdays? I forgot. Oh my god, how did I forget? You're closed on Wednesdays, right? Yes, you are. God damn it. Okay, fine. Whatever. Uh, you know what? Let's actually go ahead and do a day of foraging. We haven't done this in a while, and I'm gonna have to be doing this more often anyway. Because I need to make some- Ooh! Okay, another cutscene. Nice. Fish traps. Hello again, Dunhill. Okay. Basic bread recipes and basic dessert recipes. Okay. Thank you. Fish- okay. Fishing points. Sure. Please explain to me. Alright, here's what we can set up a fish trap. You can tell by uh, the branch sticking out of the water. While holding the fish trap, 
At a fishing point, press the A button to set the trap in the water. Then wait for a fish to get trapped. When a fish is caught in the trap, the trap will start to shake. To take the trapped fish out of the trap, press the A button at the fishing point. Isn't that easy? Okay. Got it. Hmm. Can they break? Okay. So that's another feature that we now have access to. We can use some uh, fish traps, you know. So that's pretty nice. But I'm not going to be using that quite yet. Um, instead, my plan for now is just to basically uh, end up uh, foraging here. So let's just go ahead and start from, I guess, the same thing that we always do. Getting the mint. Honeybee there. That's nice. Yeah, I guess it also helps to go this way because, as you already know, there actually are things over here to forage. Despite me not actually remembering this for a while and just forgetting about this completely, you know? Okay, only a few things though, but whatever. It's fine. It's all good. Okay, um... I did not check the bottom portion, now let me go ahead and take a look at this. Aha, there are some good stuff here. Honeycomb, specifically, okay. That's done for that. Another honeybee right there. Nice. It's gonna be a good day to forage, and I have plenty of space. Plenty of space. We drop flower. Another flower. Okay. That seems about it for that part. Except this grasshopper. Is that something there? Uh, no, it's not. Alright, so that's it for area one. A lot of good foraging done. Let's see, next one. Let's start by going this way. Mint. Weed. This, what is that? Is that a bird? It is a bird, okay. I wasn't actually sure. Alright. A flower, I'll take that. Mint. Cobain Grasshopper. And that's it for this area. Alright, what's over here? This thing? Another Grasshopper, nothing in there. I like doing this. I really like, legitimately enjoy doing this. It's so fun. This kills the time, you know, it's really cool. Ooh, one of these, okay. Spotted Ladybug. Uh, anything there? Actually, no. Let me check over here because see, during that, um, there actually, yeah, there's a weed that right there. I'm checking because during that mandatory thing, a thing was up there, but I wasn't sure if it was just scene specific or if it actually was an accurate representation of what can actually happen. In other words, things forged up there, and by the looks of it, things can be up there because I just saw a weed up there. I mean, it was only a weed, but still. Man, this is so much good stuff. Man, the problem is that it's dark now, so I, it's a little harder to actually see everything around here, you know? Okay, but I believe I'm done there. Alright, area three. Let's just finish this up real fast. Here we go. There's a shortcut there, but I don't want to take the shortcut. I want to forge some more, you know? Oh. Oh, no, wait. Oh, damn, bag is full? Really? Oh, my God. Even with that. I need to... I need to... Oh, my God. Even with that, I filled up the entire thing. That is crazy. I'm going to have to just... Oh, it's because I got fish traps, too. That wasted another space. Alright, well I got scrap metal now at least, so that's good. Let's see, anything else there? Mint, that's a weed, can't do much with that. Another mint, another weed there. Another mint. And that is about it. Okay, good. Perfect. We're done. We're done. Uh, this one was actually kind of late because we started late. 
but now I have to actually move out of here, you know, get out of here. Let's do it. Let's get out of here. Go, 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 all the freaking way. And there's, there's trees growing here too, this is crazy. Alright, well I'm pretty much done. I'm just gonna go to bed. Alright, so let's see, for tomorrow, it's the what, 26th I believe. I don't really feel like foraging, I don't want to do that. It's raining today. Great, lovely, wonderful. It's raining. Oh my god, mail. Foraging beginner? Okay. We're sure you still haven't gathered enough, uh, the anything and everything committee. What? Okay. I mean, whatever. Alright, so... Today's a relatively simple day, you know? Also, I just realized, if I cut this, would I even have an inventory spot? I do, okay. So I think tomorrow I'm going to be getting another cutscene. Uh, this time I'm going to be introduced to somebody else, a new character. At least I think so. And then here's my cow. I'm just going go ahead and quickly talk to my cow and take care of her before I end the day. Man, I haven't really accomplished much in terms of progress with days for this episode though. Like it's. I've only done like one day this episode, like this is crazy. What? Oh my god. I can't even milk my cow. Okay, but see, I wanted to kill time because uh, I need to know for sure if I can buy an upgraded bag from Hannah. Because she starts selling it. I don't know if it's like the beginning of summer or like really late spring, but she actually starts selling the upgraded bag like around this time you know and I, I keep thinking that it's like yeah it's pretty accurate you know that it's like around this time it should be fish traps for 70 each interesting um i will sell milk so i'll go ahead and do that for some money and then fathers are 60 each so that's some pretty decent cash right there if i were to just sell all that you know i get tempted sometimes but i know that i Hmm. Wait, also, what do you mean by this? Ship from inventory? Oh! Interesting. Hmm. No, I don't want to do that, no. Okay, so... The thing is, it won't open until 10, though. And, like, is it worth waiting that much time? I mean, maybe. Maybe it is. Hmm. In the meantime, I'll go ahead and water, you know, Alice. Or wa Did I just say water? Yeah, I'm just going to water my cow. I meant milk, sorry. Dude, can you... No! What are you doing? Oh my god, I just went the wrong way. I told you, man, this menu was really weird sometimes. I swear it cycles the wrong way. Well, because there's nothing else to do, I feel like I should probably forge at least like the first area, you know? Because, I mean, what am I going to do for two hours? It is Thursday, so it is actually open today. You know what, let me just do it for the river area at least, just for that. And then, whatever, you know, after that, who cares? And of course, being rainy, there's definitely some, um, frogs around in the area. Tree frog! Spotted locust. One of those. A bush brown. Okay, that's it for that. It looks like a pathway over there, but it's closed off. Hmm. It's only 8.30. What the heck? Let 
Nothing there. What about this way? Oh, mushrooms. Poison mushrooms, actually. Small branch. Not in the space in your bag. Wonderful. Love that. Love it. Oh my god, this is crazy. I cannot even get anything. Like, literally nothing. Dude, I desperately need that bag upgrade. Like, desperately need it. Dirty spaces is just like nothing in your bag, apparently, in this game. It's funny, because like in other games, it would usually be 8. Like in the older Harvest Moons, you would have like a limit of 8. And, you know, Harvest Moons, in terms of this dynamic, have changed so much over the, over the years. That like, 8 is like nothing now, you know? Because 30 is already nothing. It's almost like a version of Power Creep, but not exactly Power Creep, because that's for like, card games and stuff, or, you know, competitive games, but like... Yeah, it's still like a version of power creep if you actually think about it, you know, so I don't know I find it interesting, but man. I need that bag upgrade. I really do need that All right, you know what because it's pretty much 10 a.m. Now. I'm just gonna take the shortcut So convenient. Oh, I can take that at least so that's good All right, so let's just take the shortcut out of here and go back on this freaking mushroom Or not this mushroom next to the mushroom the mushroom helps you go up of course all right, perfect. So now, I'm gonna go to the general store. And I really wanna see what Hannah actually has available for sale here because this is gonna be very important to know because if you have the item already, then I'm actually good to go. All I really have to do here is purchase it and I'm good. So let's see what you got. Because to be honest, I haven't really paid attention as to what you have, you know? Hmm. Oh, this is awkward. Unfortunately, you don't have it. Which means I'm gonna have to wait until summer day one to purchase that thing. In the meantime, more shipping, of course. Because why not? Oh my god. Yeah, go ahead and ship that one. Um, tree frog, yes. Basically all of this stuff here. Okay. Perfect. Alright, so I'm just going to go to bed now. Screw this. Well, I guess I can just go ahead and deposit my stuff for now. Like scrap metals and small rocks and small branches. That's fine. Alright, what time is it? It is... Oh man, I'm actually up there in time. Meet the Harvest Goddess. Oh, okay. It's not a good time for a transition because I'm almost out of time for this episode. Okay. Really? Okay. Sure. Thank you for making me fly over there. That's nice. I like that. Okay. My hand. throw this into the spring. A turnip. Okay. I'm gonna throw it. Let me throw it. An offering for the harvest goddess. Dum da da da! Hello. Hmm, I like the harvest goddess design in this game. She's nice. She looks pretty, you know, very happy and friendly. Hmm. Yes, they have actually. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Supporting me. Well, thank you. An offering, no garbage. Giving gifts. So turnips are a big favorite of yours. Okay, you need to ask me something.
Alright, so now we warp yet again. This is interesting. Okay, where are we at now? How to use multiplayer is what the three is what the screen says down there. Multiplayer Plaza. Okay. Raise animals you brought here and exchange items. Um Okay, I mean I'll just say yes, but I can't use this feature because it's multiplayer, you know? I'm not gonna be doing this in the let's play. Multiplayer from the title screen, save the diary, okay. Makes sense. Alright, explain, dude. Explain. Got it. Just go talk to you, okay. See, I really don't want to go through all this. I mean, it might actually be a waste of time for all of you because I'm not going to talk about this. I'm just going to do next. Oh my god, look at all this stuff. I'm going to do enough. Okay. Cool. Well, thank you, Aaron. Cool. Bye, Harvest Goddess. It was nice seeing you. Alright. Bye-bye. Alright, so yeah. It's actually a good time to end the episode here. Perfect timing. So, um... Yeah, you know, if you enjoyed this episode in any way, please be sure to leave a like. I appreciate it very much. Thank you, and as always, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a great and, of course, a fantastic day.